Hello friends, welcome to this lecture of computer graphics. In this lecture, I am going to discuss the concept of refresh or raster display devices. So, when we come across the concept of the refresh or raster display devices, there are certain pro points that we have to keep in our mind. When we talk about refresh or raster display device, here, point is used as a basic drawing primitive so as compared to the random or random calligraphic display devices we make use of the point in refresh display devices as a basic drawing primitive that means whenever we whenever a picture is to be drawn in the system the refresh or raster display devices make use of point as a basic constituent to draw the picture on the screen. So that is the idea of the point as a basic drawing primitive in this kind of the display devices. So if any picture is to be drawn on the screen using this display device, the picture would be drawn as a point on the screen there would be small small points as you can see on the screen and these points are basically termed as pixel so pixel is a unit in terms of which the point is represented on the screen in refresh or raster display devices and what is pixel pixel basically means picture element so it is a very important term that you have to remember and at various occasion this thing is asked uh, asked that what do you mean by pixel so pixel basically implies picture element now in this concept we basically make use of scan lines to draw the picture so what is the concept of the scan line each scan line in refresh display device consists of horizontal retrace and vertical retrace There are
there are numerous pixels contained in each scan line. So, scan lines basically consist of horizontal and vertical retrace which is basically used to draw the picture on the screen and these uh, horizontal retrace and vertical retrace consist of numerous pixels So, in the scan line, there are various horizontal and the vertical retrace and in each horizontal retrace, there are numerous pixels. Let us check that here. So, what happens that So, in this kind of the display devices, there are, uh, it make use of scan lines. Here you can see that uh, there is a horizontal line. This horizontal line is known as horizontal retrace. And there are numerous horizontal retraces in a refresh display device so what happens basically that in this kind of display devices the horizontal retrace is basically travels in horizontal direction to draw the picture and it then shift to another horizontal retrace to draw the picture and it keeps moving from one horizontal retrace to another horizontal retrace to draw the picture Suppose here we have a picture that is to be drawn. So this picture can be drawn. This picture can be drawn by gluing the pixel lying on each horizontal retrace. So uh, in this the figure you can see that uh, the pixel lying on this horizontal retrace will be displayed that it will move to next horizontal retrace to draw the pixel lying on that uh, to retrace and it keeps moving in similar fashion till the time the picture is not displayed. If the picture is not displayed by traveling towards the and towards the last horizontal retrace then the then the display device make use of or another retrace that is known, known as vertical retrace. Vertical retrace. So vertical retrace is basically used that once we move towards the last horizontal retrace but still the picture is not completely drawn on the picture. Then at that time the, the, this display device will use the horizontal retrace to move towards the first horizontal retrace to again, uh, again draw the remaining part of the pixels that have left to draw the picture on the screen. So this is the idea about how the picture is displayed on refresh or raster display devices. So the important questions that are basically asked numerically on the basis of refresh or raster display devices are
नंबर वन रेजोल्यूशन सो रेजोल्यूशन इज डिफाइंड so resolution is defined as the product of number of pixels lying in horizontal and vertical direction or sometimes we basically define the resolution as so sometimes this definition is also used to define the resolution that the maximum number of pixels that can be displayed on the screen without overlapping so these two terms are these two definitions are very important with regard to the concept of the resolution now the question is basically asked to calculate the resolution for a given picture in exam so in exam we are basically provided the number of pixels suppose the number of pixels in the vertical direction is basically 1048 let us assume that and the number of the pixels along the horizontal direction is one two six four. So that is basically the number of pixel in uh, uh, in the horizontal direction and number of pixels in vertical direction. Suppose along the vertical direction. we have 1048 pixels and along the vertical direction uh, horizontal direction we have 1264 pixels so how we can find the resolution from this given data so resolution resolution can be represented as one two six four into one zero four eight that is a uh, number of pixels in horizontal direction and number of pixels in vertical direction and this will give us the number of pixels as the resolution for a given picture so this is how uh, you can solve the equation asked in the uh, in a question so 
Another thing that you have to keep in this regard is that Suppose the resolution of a picture on screen be M cross N and its refresh rate is r frame per second so suppose there is a picture which has n pixels in vertical direction and m pixels in horizontal direction and R be the refresh rate of this picture. So, number of number of pixels would be given by horizontal retrace. Always remember that. Horizontal retrace. The number of pixels would be given by horizontal retrace and number of scan lines would be given by vertical retrace. Fine. So number of pixels for a given question can be determined through the horizontal retrace. You simply determine uh, through the horizontal retrace, that means how many horizontal retraces are there to determine the number of pixels. Fine. Uh, the number of pixels lying in each horizontal retrace we can determine. And number of scan line we can determine through vertical retrace. That means once we move towards uh, from the bottom or uh, from the last horizontal retrace to the the beginning of the beginning horizontal retrace would give us a scan line. So scan line is determined through vertical retrace. This is the first important relation that you have to keep. Fine. And the second important relation that you have to remember while solving the question related to refresh or raster display devices are how we can determine number of horizontal retrace. How we can determine number of horizontal retrace? So it is basically determined through n minus 1 into r. n minus 1, that means number of, you can see the, these are the horizontal retraces. We have to first count how many horizontal retraces are there. And uh, for m cross into n resolution, we have n minus 1 into r r is a refresh rate v and what is the refresh rate the number of picture to be redrawn fine fine so an entire picture would re uh, represent uh, n minus 1 horizontal retrace and into r re uh, refresh rate to give us the number of horizontal retrace so horizontal retrace can be determined through this relation now if we have determined number of vertical retrace the simple equation would be r minus 1 so these two important relation could give you uh, the idea how we can re obtain horizontal retrace and vertical retrace for a given picture so this is all about the refresh or the raster display devices in our next lecture we will discuss on the numerical problems that are basically asked in association with this concept.